Talk about weather now and with that polar vortex approaching, grape growers in Niagara are keeping a close eye on the th thermometer. If temperatures dip to a certain low, it could cause serious damage to their vines. And as Adam Atkinson explains, some wineries will go to great lengths to protect their crops. At Fielding Estates Winery in Lincoln, Curtis Fielding is getting ready for a cold weekend. Friday night into Saturday morning is where I'm going to probably not be sleeping much. Fielding says when the mercury dips to around minus 18 or 19, his vines could be damaged. So if it goes below minus 18, 19, we start to see the buds getting damaged. So they start burning and it'll reduce our crop for the next year. He says using a system developed by Brock University, he can predict how much damage the cold weather will cause. They take bud cuttings from out in different fields and they take them back to a freezer at Brock University in simple terms and drop the temperature in the freezer and they can actually tell us what temperature we're going to see the damage. If the temperature dips to that minus 18 or 19, it could destroy 10% of his vines. That's your profit margin for the year grower. It, you know, we work with tight margins growing grapes and you know, any damage is bad damage. Over at Flat Rock Cellars near Jordan Station, their threshold is a little colder. If it goes down to minus 20, we should be fine, but anything much lower than that, we'll, we'll start to get a little bit anxious. As bitterly cold as it actually feels with the wind chill, and trust me, it feels really cold, the wind is actually a grape grower's friend because it helps keep the temperatures up. Our major concern is when there is no wind and it's very, very cold out and there's no airflow to move that cold air off the vineyard floor. And that's why we have the wind machines to, uh, it's a tool in our arsenal to try and work with mother nature to get a little bit of protection. While Flat Rock Cellars uses their rolling terrain. We'll actually be a couple degrees warmer up here compared to what it will be um, like at the lake. And that couple of degrees can make all the difference. Other grape growers in the area even hire helicopters to move cold air around. Anything to protect the vines. Adam Atkinson, CHH News, Niagara.